the just ended Spring Festival holiday, ushering in the year of the rabbit, has served as an important window for the outside to observe China's economy. 308 million domestic trips were made in China, generating a domestic tourism revenue of 375.843 billion yuan, up 30 percent year on year. China's express delivery industry handled more than 700 million parcels, nearly two times of the figure in 2019. The box office made this year's holiday the second highest grossing to date. Strong consumer sentiment has sent positive signals of a rebounding Chinese economy to the world. According to CNBC, more recent data show Chinese consumers are starting to open their wallets again, especially for travel. Consumer sentiment is better. Spending power is kind of back, citing numerous chief Chinese economist Ting Lu said in a report. Pent-up demand is being released as many people rush to scenic spots, watch firework shows, and crowd into restaurants and hotels. DW reported on his website that after the week-long Lunar New Year holiday, with consumption rebounding, people are feeling more positive about the economic prospects. The Rising Nepal, an English newspaper in Nepal, wrote on his website that the economic impact of the Spring Festival period would be significant in setting the tone for the year ahead. In particular, it will mark the return of China's consumer, retail, leisure, and travel industries. Citing an observer's analysis, it says the year of the rabbit would be a more prosperous one for everyone involved. Financial Times in UK reported on January 29th that multinationals, including Unilever, have said in recent weeks they were expecting a rebound in demand in China, and banks, including Morgan Stanley, have increased their Chinese growth forecasts for 2023. The recovering Chinese economy is also heating up the global economy. The New York Times reported that the Chiang Mai office of the Tourism Authority estimates that the city will welcome back more Chinese visitors the second quarter this year, who will spend about 230 million dollars. A recent UBS report said that China has played a meaningful role as a global growth engine, not only benefiting Chinese companies and its people. But many other developing and developed markets.